There's a three in here. There it is, there it is, there it is. Hey guys, we're out here in Revontuli Coast and today we're gonna to be hunting waterfowl. In today's video, I'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do to hunt waterfowl and Revontuli is the absolute best map for doing this. Waterfowl hunting is so much fun. It can be a great way to get a lot of cash and lots of diamonds and trophies to be had. So right now we are in the bottom right-hand island in Revontuli Coast and this island is absolutely amazing for hunting just about every waterfowl species there is on this amazing map. Now, if you do enjoy today's video, guys, or learn anything at all, go ahead and hit that like button. Definitely let me know in the comments what your best duck trophy is so far and which one you would love to put in your trophy lodge and we're gonna head straight into it. Okay, so the first thing I did, guys, was put the time back. I like to start hunting for waterfowl early in the morning. So right now it is just about 7 a.m. Okay guys, so when you are setting up to hunt waterfowl, you do need some sort of hunting structure to hunt from so that you have reduced hunting pressure. Now you can use the Incognito Deluxe Waterfowl Blinds. I like these a lot. The benefit of these is that you can actually look straight up in the air. Whereas when you are in an Incognito Deluxe Water Layout Blind, which do have their benefits, you cannot look straight up. So there are some blind spots, but the nice thing about being in the Water Layout Blind is that you're right in the water water with the ducks. Then there is an incognito deluxe layout blind. These are great when you're hunting ducks and geese on ground and you also can use a tripod if you wish. But most of the time I do prefer to use this, the deluxe waterfowl blinds, and I will show you why. So when I am hunting waterfowl guys, what I carry with me is a shotgun. I do like the Catchatory 12 gauge. It is non-DLC and it has six shots. You do have to unlock it if you are a new player, but any shotgun will do with the birdshot ammo of course then I do have both of the 22s with me now I only need one I do prefer the Virant 22 because it has 10 shots whereas the Zarza 22 only has five shots and having 10 shots is definitely gonna help you out then I am carrying with me all of the duck collars that are in the game not every species of duck has a collar but usually just having the decoys out is enough to bring the ducks in and the geese and most of these collars will come with the Revon Thule DLC and you'll want to pick some sort of layout blind. And I like to use the Hyperion, but you also can use the Red Raptor Reflex Sight. We'll start with actually that on the Cachatory so that I can show you that. And we have the Hyperion on the Virant 22. So I am all set up here, but if you're not set up, the first thing you want to do is put down decoys for whatever duck species you would like to hunt for. Now you can mix up your species. You don't have to just put one species at a setup and put them all separate. You can definitely mix the different species of ducks together and have them all come in at the same time. Now, usually 15 decoys will do just fine. You'll want to mix up the different kinds and we already have ducks coming in. So the first thing you want to do is spot every single one of them if you are looking for trophies. Now what I actually do is I have a little list beside me telling me what the diamond trophy rating is for all of the ducks that I have decoys for here because I don't have a very good memory. That's the Red Raptor site. You can actually customize it in the settings and I will show you that in just a second. I'm gonna zero to 75. Now some people like to shoot them out of the water and then out of the sky. Some people only like to shoot them when they're flying. However you like to hunt ducks, is totally up to you. The main objective is to have fun. Now, when you're shooting ducks in the sky, you wanna lead the shot. What that means is you don't want to aim right at the duck. You want to aim in front of it so it flies into your shots. Otherwise, you will miss it. With the Red Raptor scope, you cannot zoom in with it. So you do definitely want to practice with this, but you definitely can get good with it. If you would like to customize it, you can go into System, Interface, scroll all the way down, and there is the Reflex Sight Reticle Shape. You can change the sight reticle shape, color, size, and opacity, and the lens color and opacity. Why don't we try blue. So that's the blue. Now if you don't like that sight, you can use the shotgun scope. Now that is something you are going to have to unlock as a new player. But the nice thing with the scope is that it does zoom in and out so you do have magnification. And sometimes it's very handy because ducks are very very tiny. And the other thing you can do is just pop the scope off and use your shotgun with no scope. Now that takes some practice, but you definitely can get good at it. So what I usually do is take my shots, I'll usually empty my shotgun of the six shots, and then without reloading, I will cycle over to my Virant 22. That gives me 10 more shots and continue shooting. But once they get up in the sky, 
They are not easy since the rework to the waterfowl system a few updates ago. They will zig, they will zag, and they are not going to make your life easy. So I have Eurasian Widgeon decoys here and Eurasian Teal, both of which have a collar. So there's my Teal collar, there's my Widgeon collar. All right, let's put out a couple calls, see if we can get some ducks in here. I'm actually going to call both species in. So when they come flying in, you want to spot every single one of them. If you are looking for a diamond, usually they are level 3, but they can make diamonds at level 2. So what I do is I have a little list of the diamond trophy ratings on a piece of paper beside me while I am hunting for ducks until I have their diamond trophy rating memorized. I just don't have the best of memories. Okay. Oh, hello. Blood. So I took the shot in front of him as you may have noticed he flew into my shot and we dropped him So you want to reload right away so you are ready when the next set of ducks comes in Usually I don't pick them up right away I will wait now if you have your dog with you which I actually do Get him to lay down because we are really really close to the ducks and he definitely can spook them So when you see the diamond trophy score in the estimate for any level 2 That is a diamond potential duck and that is one that I really focus on getting down just in case it might score diamond. And that is what we're looking for here are some diamond duckies. So there you go. Beautiful Eurasian teal. Aren't they gorgeous? All you need is one pellet to hit it that actually was a pretty far shot, 51 meters. And this guy is a 336 and 354 is diamond. Paid me $320, which isn't a huge amount. But if you take down a whole pile of ducks, you really can make some cash. Now, guys, I do have a Ravantuli waterfowl super guide, which will show you exactly where all the hot spots are for every duck species and goose species on this map and how to hunt them. And I will leave the link here on the screen and below the video. Got him. And the other tip I have for you guys is when you are setting up to hunt ducks, load up your inventory to the max so this can't happen. It is easy to accidentally pick up your duck decoys and it is kind of annoying. So there she is. Ooh, that was a very far shot, 83.82 meters. So expecting to get more from even further is kind of ridiculous. Beautiful. Oh, and see, and I accidentally picked up a stinking decoy. So <laughs> we got two there. Might have been able to get three, but that was pretty sweet. Not too bad. Now we did do some waterfowl hunting on stream yesterday and we had a lot of fun. Let's have a look at that footage right now. 905, we have a diamond potential one. 354, right? Okay. This, this one has a good shot at making diamond, doesn't it? Eurasian teal? 354. Okay, land my dude. Land my dude, wouldn't that be insane? Land, come on. Come on, you can do it. He's gonna land, here he goes, here he goes. There he is, there he is. Okay. Splat, I didn't reload. I think we got a few there. Let's go see what happened. Remem reminder to reload. This isn't the one. That's a level one. Oh, look at that. That's a big one. <laughs> 347 and 354 is diamond. I wasn't always super good at this. I still don't think I'm super awesome. I can always improve, but all you, all you can do is practice. That one's diamond potential too. Dude, okay. 352 it starts at. That's him. He's landing right. No! Ah, sweet shot! We got him! That's way too far away. Alright, let's go get him. This is too much fun, guys! This is too much fun. He's like, I'm gonna land! No, I'm not! How you doing, my dude? Oh, 352.75! Defensive. Well, got him. Let's reload. We got one of them. There's a three in here. Oh my gosh, please, please let me find it. There it is, there it is, there it is. Where are you going? It's way far away. I'm gonna use my 22. 
That's it right there. Are you coming in? It's right. It's gonna come in. I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna be patient. Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I think that's it. I gotta, I gotta spot it. That's it right there. Okay. Okay, here I go. I think I got it! <laughs> I think I got it! I hope I got it! Let's go see. <laughs> oh, please be the right duck. Please be the right duck. Come on. Come on. How you doing, my buddy? No, it's not! No, 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 no! Darn it! Oh my gosh! All right. It's never gonna come back. Oh, that's so, that's such a shame. There isn't another one, is there, dog? Here, track for me. Is there any blood? He is searching for blood. Hold on. Is there blood over there? Is there any blood over here, my dude? I didn't get two, did I? I did! Hold on, there's another duck! Oh, please. Oh, 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 oh. Yes! <laughs> we got it! We got a Eurasian teal! We got it! Oh, I thought I muffed it! I thought I muffed it! I did not! Let's taxi that! Well, geez, that didn't take very long, did it? That's awesome! 354 on the nose! 0.98 over diamond! I did it! <laughs> you guys knew I killed two before I did! That's absolutely amazing! Only one pellet in him! Oh, that's a little scary! But that's all right. Very, very sweet. And this is where, this is where we got him. Bottom right hand corner. Click right here, guys, for how to hunt and all the hotspots for every single waterfowl species in Revontuli Coast. This is the Revontuli Super Guide. Thanks for watching, guys. And we will definitely see you guys in the next one.